Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is Bubble Bath or Lemon Lime here with some more of my realism let's play. We are using MP5 and 357 Magnum. We're in round 12 because um, my last recording kind of messed up, but you know, that don't matter exactly because the, the earlier rounds it was slow as hell. It was 30 minutes just to get to round 12. Or now on the higher rounds where it's more fast paced, so you'll be able to get through more rounds in about the same amount of time. So, and there's actually more action to go along with it, more talking and shit, so let's get into it. Um, Let's talk about the topic right now is the old YouTube and the only reason I bring up this topic is because this video was an example or this map is an example of it on the old YouTube I always used to explore stuff when I mean the old YouTube I'm talking about like my first ever account which was milk Dudster. It had no it had like 10 subscribers on it I think but it had a shitload of friends. Remember YouTube friends? But none of you know what a fuck a YouTube friend was. You were actually able to add friends on YouTube, which was kick ass at the time. Because you were able to... Holy shit, I just got like 10 perks there. But with YouTube friends, you were actually able to share videos and shit without like, you know, actually messaging a subscriber. You just like send it to like this friend or whatever and blah blah blah. Well. I was reading up on this map, Shinonuma. By the time this came out is when I um, when I first created the channel. So I was reading up on this map, and one of my friends said, "You want to know something interesting?" And I thought this was a lie at first. And her name is actually Saw Amy Thirty Three, and she doesn't have a YouTube anymore, unfortunately. But she was a good friend. Um, I think her name's Marissa or something, but. Anyways, we used to do Sonic videos together with um, this other kid named Ness Boy who lives in Australia. So she's like, you want to know something about Shinonuma? And I'm like, sure. She's like, the map was never intended to be in the game. I'm like, hmm, really? When I read about this, and she was right about this, the map is a custom map. Duris was supposed to be the next map pack, and there was only supposed to be three maps of zombies. They said three was a... For one, the only reason this map was ever played in the game was so that Darius could be delayed so they could get the pack punch everything working, right? Well, three was an oblique number for one, so if there were three maps, I wouldn't I wouldn't allow that. I wouldn't like it, I should say. Secondly, this map, the reason it's a custom map is because three people, three people from the Nazi Zombie development team at Treyarch made this map as a side job and were implemented, or were implemented to put it into their copies of the game for Xbox and PS3 or whatever. Well, when they figured out that Duris is going to be delayed another month, they said, well, we got a map that we can put in place. They showed the advisor Shinonuma, and then Shinonuma was put into place with a lot of tweaks. Um, here are things that were not in the first version of this map. One, the huts. Not, not that hut. That hut was original. But these huts is like the one over here. This is actually supposed to be a barrier wall. And on one end, there would be a gun. And on the other end, there would be the mystery box thingy. And what the perks were supposed to do, the perks were supposed to be randomly scattered across 300 different points on the map. What I mean by this is that speed cola could be in the first room along with quick revive, juggernaut, or double tap. Actually, all four perks could be in the first room. The only problem with that is, what if all four perks were in the first room, along with the mystery box? Well, you don't need to leave the first room. You technically don't. So the advisor changed stuff around and added in the hut, which I thought was a kick-ass idea at the time. But then I look back at it, and it's like, eh, it would have been awesome to have a different randomized perk. But he's like, the randomized perk idea was picked up still. When you open up these hut doors, you know... Your perks get randomized. For example, Speakle is there, but there's been times where I got Juggernaut, Double Tap, or Quick Revive there. It was a good, it was a good, um, what is it, add-on to a map. Another thing that wasn't supposed to be in the map was, um, the Wonder Waff. The Wonder Waff, as you all know, is the electric, I call it the electric gun for short, because Wonder Waff, everybody's like, no, it's the Wonder Waffle, and it's like, you can't fucking read, or you got a small enough TV. But... The Wonder Waff, the electric gun in my opinion, is when you shoot it, it shocks off all these zombies. Like I shoot it right now and all throughout the zombies. Pretty kick-ass gun in my opinion. And we're going to grab this insta-kill and kill off the two bosses. 
So that was never planned for the game. What was implemented was a nuke gun. What this was is that this there was a gun. It had five bullets, and which you could place five different nukes. And it kind of looked like a 357 Magnum, but it was a little bit more oblique. But what you do is you shot it at the ground, and within 30 seconds, the, this area would be new. It'd be a 20-foot radius. So what I would do is, if you place it in the middle of the map, you would have to go to a hut or something. But I would have placed it, like, right here, and ran out to the main hut. Because that would have been a good spot to new. But what I do is, I circle around and go the long way or whatever. It's kind of hard to explain, but that would have been sweet to have a nuke gun. But instead, there was an electric gun, and yeah. But anyways, the reason that I brought this up for the old YouTube is because this was the start of the old YouTube for me. I never found YouTube until I got a computer, which is around the time that I got this. So, when I found the old YouTube, I, was, I remember watching, you know, custom World at Warcraft and... was that? Oh yeah, so this was the start of the old YouTube. I remember like all the Call of Duty crap that was custom and then Sonic, like old crap, custom Sonic stuff like Sonic shorts and all that, which I'm going to go back and actually watch and, you know, get into it and stuff. But, you know, I, I miss the old YouTube. I'd give anything to have the old YouTube back. And my phone's ringing, I don't like that. I don't like when my phone's ringing when I'm recording crap. Every time I try to record something, something's got to mess up. My old recording messed up, but that was because it got interrupted. My crap just got interrupted by my mother I'm just oh I'm a busted nut over somebody I swear to god no, I want it not over you guys are watching it's just yeah, a little bit angry don't keep getting angry but yeah I would give anything for the old YouTube what included in the old YouTube was Sonic 06 um, in case if you guys don't know Sonic 06 was considered to be the worst Sonic game of all time um, this is completely wrong. I don't care how glitchy it was or how hard it was to follow. It was a good game. It was a good starter for the PS3. You introduced it silver. It introduced it all these different hedgehogs. And it was just... I don't see why people say it was a bad game. Yeah, the glitches were kind of stupid. But, you know, the game was also rushed. So you can't really blame it on, you know, the game developers. You wanted the game that early... It's your fault, Sega. All right, not Sega, but Sega fans. Sega fans were the reason that the game was rushed. They didn't want it by Christmas. No, they said they were going to release it in March when it was its original release date. Many Sega fans were complaining because they wanted it for Christmas or their kids wanted it for Christmas, so they had to rush it. And this is what you got. So you can't. If you blame it on Sega, you're just a bad person. If you were a person that wanted that game by December, you're a bad person. I, I honestly should slap you, because that game could have been good. Well, actually, it was good. It could have been great, I should say. But, you know, idiots have to be idiots. So. Huh. Well, let's talk about what happened yesterday. I was playing football with um, Slim Sweezy and a couple other buddies, and, well, you can already see where this is going. Something got hurt. Sure enough, my ankle. But it wasn't how you expect. You see, I fall victim to a lot of potholes. Nobody else does, just me. I'm the only person that ever fucking falls into a pothole. Well, I fell into one, and I heard three cracks, and I fell straight over. And everybody thought I was faking it because I didn't want to play football. I did want to play football. I don't see why everybody said that I didn't want to play football. The teams were great. They weren't uneven. I was one that begged everybody else to fucking play for once. I don't get why they say I don't want to play. It was a good matchup. I mean, like, I got an interception before that, except this little fucking dumbass named Dante stripped the ball from me immediately after. You know, I was messing up on completing passes and shit, but then, then again, the only person that was completing a pass was either Dante on the other team or Lalo on my team. It was just... I just hate when I fucking break or sprain something or twist or whatever you want to call it. I just hate it. I fucking hate it. Alright, well, we're gonna go trade in this Magnum right here. I haven't gotten the box yet. This is my starter shit. Alright, 
right, we got the... I thought this was the Ranger. I've been playing too much on W2, ain't I? Um, so let's try one more. Alright, let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get the fuck off me, bitch. Just get back to the calm area. Alright, that's how the fuck you do it with the Desert Eagle. <laughs> this might how stupid that sounded, but... I love the Eagle, it's way better than the Magnum. So, I'm all set. Here's the COD 4 weapons. This is actually an old COD 4 setup that I had. The MP5 with the blue tiger camo. Always had a silencer on that. And I had the Desert Eagle. Yeah, I'm all set, man. I'm about to go play COD 4 after this. Alright, we're getting, we're getting a little bit of ammo. Wait until somebody hits, then you take off. And what I'm going to do is regenerate all my ammo, then kill them off. Could use another ammo pack to even this all up. Sixty-nine. Fuck it. All right. So round seventeen. Let's go. Round seventeen. We're we're all set on full ammo now. <sighs> bosses three. Three bosses. Let's go. We can fucking. We'll get right past these motherfuckers. Uh, fuck you. Fuck you. Love realism so much, man. It's just it's so realistic. Ha <laughs> bad pun. I'm just wondering when I'll die. I'm not even gonna die. I'm not gonna die anytime soon. I can already see that. But if I do, then, you know, hypocrite me all you want. Why is it frame dropping? I, I cannot have this right now. My game randomly drops frames. I don't understand why. Yeah, motherfuckers. Alright, we're gonna enable the challenge bar. I don't understand. I kill more than two people, but yet it only counts for two people. And again, there's bosses, so. And playing COD 4 practically. Whoa, whoa, what is this? What is this? Oh, no, I. I missed both of them, fuck. <sighs> Alright, let's go. Don't worry, don't worry, that's not the, that's the least of my worries. Steady aim? Why can't I get overkill? I just want overkill. Wait, I could be using this time to go to the box. I got a ray gun and wonder waffle be said. Or actually I don't even want the wonder waffle. Well shit, I killed one. Right, wait, I just yeah, I knew I killed one of them. What the fuck? I don't want the STG either. Jesus, I just want a good gun. Oh my fucking world. Fucking double barrel. I'm getting the shittiest weapon on the earth. Alright. Drag it off. Teddy bear, of course. Oh, time to run around. I just want to know where the box is. Oh shit, of course it'd be in storage. I must be an engine. What? 
What kind of bullshit? That's fucking stupid. I was gonna buy the trench gun just in case, because that's like one of my favorite all-time weapons. the boss alright that is except for the fact that I just blew his arm off and there we go this is what we wanted alright we're good we're good where are you at whoa shit I don't want to take my chances with that alright um I, I think we, we should go one more round let's go one more round Is it a dog round? Oh, I love the dog rounds. I love the puppy rounds. They're, they're the best. Let's go. Na 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 na. Hey 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 hey. Get my camera. It's from South Park. Good show. Na 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 Hey yeah hey, yeah hey, yeah I can't fucking sing right now. I'm being an idiot. Whoa, 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 what what the fuck was that? <sighs> Alright. Well, this is the end of this video. Please comment, rate, subscribe to Lemon Lime. For more, check out Slim Sweezy's Minecraft Let's Play very soon, and until then, I am Bubble Beth, I am out.